I am Eric Call, your success counselor edge, and today we're going to talk about system equity, sweat equity, and how to use those to your advantage. Now you hear all the time, hey, you have to work hard. Then you also hear, hey, you also have to work smart. Well, you actually have to do both. And so some people get that a little bit confused, but we're going to talk about sweat equity, system equity, working hard, working smart, and utilizing those to your advantage so you can put yourself in position to achieve your desired outcomes. Let's get started. So first is sweat equity. We know that's based on our energy, based on our effort, the hard work that we do, and that is definitely something that is important. You have to put forth energy, effort, and time when you're working to produce things, working to get things done, and also those things you do to practice your craft and improve and be the best at what it is that you do. But with sweat equity or hard work, there's limits on that. There's limits to what you can do because you may get tired, you may get sick, you may have other things that put impede what you can do from a physical and mental standpoint. And if it's purely just based on sweat equity, it is difficult to measure, difficult to track, and also therefore difficult to improve. Hard work is important. That's going to get you in the game. That's going to get you started. But you're going to need a little bit more if you want to take things to the next level. And that's where working smart comes in. So let's talk about systems or system equity. We see systems around us all the time. I'm breathing right now. That's my respiratory system. We got uh, my blood flow, circulation, all those types of things. We see teams, they have a playbook. That's their system. So systems are all around us and people use those to their advantage and their benefit. So there's a lot of benefits to utilizing systems that you want to take advantage of, whether you're taking advantage of a system already there or you create a system from scratch. Now, when you first do it, the first thing is it's going to give you the benefit of seeing things out, thinking to the process, thinking through the process and finding ways to improve that process. The second thing it's going to do is going to create consistency. You're going to be able to see and do and repeat those patterns over and over again. That's going to improve the quality of the work the quality of your outcomes. The third thing is it's going to let you see where areas of improvement you're going to be able to create, uh, create ideas and implement those ideas. Let's just say you have an assembly line, everything is going great, and then you see this one area where you can improve. So having that system allows you to have a bird's eye view, come up with ideas, and then implement and improve on those types of things. Fourth thing, it's going to save you money. And then the fifth, it's going to allow for duplication, whether you want to duplicate that over and over again, or you want to share those with other individuals. System stand for save yourself stress, time, energy, and money. Now, you have to look for ways and systems that are going to benefit you to improve the areas that you want to improve in and to multiply your sweat equity. Now, you got to work hard, now you got to work smart. Now, you want to work hard while working smart, that is to increase the volume and the input of things going through your system so you can improve your desired outcomes. Now, what are your thoughts on this? What types of systems have you used to help you improve your life? Or what types of areas of your life you want to utilize to improve going forward? Put your comments down in the comment section down below. If you like this type of content, comment, share, like, subscribe, turn on notifications so you don't miss any of the content I put out. I am Eric Hall, your success concierge, providing you the vision, tools, and opportunity for your desired success.